Hi Sagittarius singles out there welcome back to I Enigma this is Enigma we're going to do your December singles read this is also going to resonate pretty much with your uh, if you're in a relationship or a situation ship, this will definitely resonate, but it's mostly for singles out there. This is a general reading, so take what resonates and leave what does not resonate for personal one-on-one -on -one nominal reading. You guys can reach out on WhatsApp, Instagram, and email details are mentioned down below. Also, do white prayer based spells for your highest good, and we have intention-based crystals. And follow my Instagram for upcoming December horoscopes by today or tomorrow, and check out client feedbacks. I also have my Scorpio channel in case you're dealing with a Scorpio or your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus or Mercury in Scorpio. Don't forget to subscribe to my Scorpio channel as well as my main channel which is I Enigma so that I put more videos for you and don't forget to subscribe to my Hindi channel if you know Hindi which is I Enigma Hindi. Scorpio. Sorry, Sagittarius. It's easy to say that is why I said Scorpio. For some of you are actually dealing with a Scorpio here. Okay, uh, Sagittarius, what I'm seeing over here is that right now you're a little confused. Maybe you have options and opportunities that uh, universe wants you to embark on, but you're not sure whether you should take this up or you should wait. So there's something that you're in this uh, confusion, uh, confusion state of mind. You're like, should I, should I not? Okay, if there's someone in your life you're confused whether this person likes you or not, or you're confused about... Should I, should I think about marriage? Should I think about career my uh, first, you know? Sagittarius, that's what is going on. The judgment. I feel like there's a decision, an important decision that you're meant to make. And that's confusing you, okay? You are thinking about something in your mind and you're not sure what to do about that, okay? There's a decision that you need to make, but you're not sure what decision you should be making regarding some aspect in your life. So right now you're in this unable to make a decision. That's the energy. Then we have Knight of Wands. I am seeing Sagittarius that you are literally going uh, like your slope is going up. Your growth is taking place. You started to enjoy your own company. I'm feeling even though there's some sort of confusion in your life, you're still going with the flow. You're like a water. You're still like, you're flexible with any kind of circumstances. You're able to adjust yourself, adapt yourself to the same situation. Okay. So it's like you're living your life on your own terms, goals, rules, regulations. It's not like you're someone else is controlling you or telling you don't do, don't do this, do that. So I feel like even though everything is, uh, you know, um, like something you're getting confused about, but everything around you is just super amazing. It's like you have the power to live your life your own terms. And I'm also seeing there's something about your skill you've recently developed and you might be learning more about your skills, about your career, about your field, and you're getting much more skilled into it much more polished into it and with more confidence you're feeling like flying higher your your goals like you're setting your goals higher and higher and higher your ambitions are getting bigger and bigger with time Sagittarius so it's like there's a fire in you that never ends it just gets bigger and bigger okay but there's something that you're deciding upon maybe it's about your skill it's about should I learn this skill or should I just stay where I am or should I choose this one or this one like you have two options in your career opportunities you're like should I embark on this or should I embark on this or should I remain in the same stage so this is something that like a major decision that you are thinking a lot about, even though your life is really good. And I'm seeing there's growth, no matter what you choose. There's definitely growth here. I'm also seeing that the universe is asking you to take a chill pill, relax, and you will get the answer. So yeah, I'm seeing with Nine of Wands is like, you might be traveling or you will actually take up something or there's a decision that you will be making where your new journey in career will start okay there's a new beginning in your career where you will be laying a solid foundation you have big plans ahead sagittarius okay all right page of ones 
seven of wands. It's like you don't want to think anymore. It's like you just want to take action. It's time that you're not ready to think anymore into this. If you want something, you're going to take action. You're going to take a step forward. You're going to move forward. You've had a lot of thinking. You have uh, all the, you know, you know the knowledge. You have the knowledge for... Uh, what you want to do and it's time for you to take action after thorough thinking after a thorough like analysis you've made a decision to move past your comfort zone i would say you're not like uh, limiting yourself to the same place same situation you're going beyond that so it's as if you're coming out of your comfort zone releasing the foundations boundaries you're having okay and taking that leap of faith towards new journey in your life there's someone that has an eye on you sagittarius i feel like if, if this is you if you're a man watching this i feel you're very excited about this new love that's coming into your life you might meet this person related to work but you guys will have a lot of indifferences thoughts are different but when you meet you guys will like uh would love to compete with each other to the point that you guys will actually fall in love with each other so i'm sensing that you have deep desire to achieve something big and there's no one that can stop you're like a lion right now there's no stoppage like you you are the king like people are asking you for any kind of you know um job offer or if you're the one that people are relying on your boss is relying on you might be a boss yourself as well so i am seeing you're moving towards growth like you will be um rising i'm sensing you might get promotions after promotions there's authority that's coming to you if you're a female watching this i feel like you've been waiting on this love but you're also limiting yourself because right now you kind of don't really have time to open up your heart. You're more interested in your career. You're more interested in building a solid foundation, traveling, working, having a name for yourself or learning new skills and just living your life. Okay. But there's someone that has been trying to contact you. There's someone that is following. You might not know this. Or you're about to meet someone that's going to follow you everywhere. I feel this person is trying to connect with you on an energetic level. Because when they see you, when they met you, they're like, okay, this, this Sagittarius is someone that I really need to know. So it's like you're attracting this person because you're more interested in your own life. This is more about like self-love right now. You're loving yourself the way you are. Okay, you're just... You're just being a better person than who you were before. So you're you're rising. I feel there's someone on your vibration that you will be meeting that will instantly feel a burning desire to get to know you, to be with you. So I am sensing there's a communication that is about to come. Someone is going to call you. Let's see more to this. What's going to happen? For some of you, this is already happening. And we have the Three of Pentacles and the Magician. This could be someone from your workplace that's wanting to be in a partnership. They might offer you collaboration, partnership, or they might want to work with you, or they might be your team member. But this person is thinking about, you know, um, changing the dynamics between you guys. Right now, you guys might be professional, and you guys may be talking about work, but they want to change the dynamics. They want to take this towards relationship towards getting to know each other on a deeper level and then building a solid foundation with each other because this person is looking for a partner and so are you but what they can see is you're pretty busy okay you're doing your own thing this could be a libra gemini aquarius but i'm seeing this person is trying to manifest you into their life six of pentacles i'm seeing an offer coming in this person is going to call you message you or going to ask you out or they might come towards you by offering you a deal or offering your project or offering you to work with them so i feel they are planning to get closer to you by offering you something 
okay so there's some like some sort of uh, financial exchange is also what i'm seeing for some of you this could be a senior person at your workplace this could be your boss they can see you being extremely uh, reserved they can see you being protective of your resources they can see you that you're not not interested in opening up your heart you're more interested in your business or your work or whatever but this person really is appreciating you for not giving out your energy anywhere you know with just anyone so this is something that they're respecting but i feel like they are actually started to see you as if you're on a pedestal and this person wants to grow themselves uh to be a better person so they can match you your vibration they can be at your level someone is trying to be at their at your level to make a proposal towards you this could be an aries this person is actually watching you from afar maybe this is your senior your boss or someone that is older than you but i'm seeing this is highly authoritative figure this is someone that is or if you're a man watching this this is you okay you will become a highly authoritative figure but i feel the masculine over here is going to rise a lot i'm seeing that very strongly is very authoritative and uh, might get a government job something like job permanency or an entrepreneurship but they this person is growing okay three of ones you guys may meet each other or travel with each other okay while you're traveling so sagittarius it's very important you may be shifting to another place you might meet this person in another place or you guys are traveling and then you meet this person or they're going to take you somewhere while traveling talk about work but also at the same time getting to know you okay so I'm seeing this is someone new and they feel like you don't have time much. But this person wants your time and attention. I'm seeing Sagittarius is very strongly. The moon. Three of swords. Something from the past still hurts you. Something from the past or I feel like you have options but you're not getting. Uh, you're not able to trust these options. You're like, when will I find my partner? You're you're completely shut the door on this topic or you're completely ignoring this topic because whenever you go out and try to find love for yourself, you see there are options, but none of them worth waiting for, okay? So it's like killing you, but you may not know this. This person is somewhere around you in your vicinity who knows you, who can see you. It's not through social media. That is going to make a move towards you. Right now, it is important, Sagittarius, to completely get out of this energy of I don't have love or I can't find love or stuff like that, okay? Pay more focus to your money, to your business, to your work, job. That's what I'm seeing. I'm seeing a cancer coming in for some of you. I feel there's no more crying for you, Sagittarius. That's also what I'm seeing. You're no more crying over things. You're just being your own powerful self solid self pa page of wands okay page of one page of swords sorry i'm seeing you taking up a you know um higher study you guys might be thinking of giving an exam then that's a message you will be clearing those exams with flying colors or it could be your person is closely watching you and they can see how much you're you know getting success like this person has closely watched your success whoever this is they've been by your side they've been around you they've closely watched you growing and this person feels like wow sagittarius has made so much out of nothing look at them how much they've achieved till now so it feels like sagittarius you will be achieving a lot of accolades while you're on your way to success you will be achieving a lot of merits appreciation money projects whatever your work is it's like you're growing it's like more money coming in more money coming in more positions more authority so it makes you happy it makes you feel proud of yourself Sagittarius right now if this is something about a higher study then it's a message to you that go for it okay and this is not the time for you to linger on love situation. If something has to happen, it will happen. But there, there's definitely one person, maybe another fire sign that's closely watching you. That's for sure. Okay. This person is planning to reach out to you, to offer you 
but this person is feeling like there's a burning desire this person feels towards you there's a strong sense of attraction they feel towards you and this is going to be revealed in this month of uh, december okay so sagittarius maybe this is another scorpio maybe this is a scorpio i'm sensing five of they cannot afford losing you they can't afford losing you because this person is someone that has learned a lot and grown out of uh, love as well in the recent past and they have the uh, fear of losing their loved ones and they cannot go through the same phase again so your person has gone through some trauma in the recent past and i feel like because they don't want to experience that again, they will come towards you with a new beginning. They'll let you know that they feel for you and that they have that this desire to get to know you and they will reveal everything uh, and it will come to you as a big, big surprise. Sagittarius. Yeah, Eight of Cups. Please clarify. I'm going to see why am I getting this. Five of Cups and Eight of Cups. This person definitely has a fear of losing you. Okay. Queen of Wands. You're difficult to handle. This is something that they've understood. You're difficult to handle. And if they lose you, they lose you for life. So they have to rush. They don't they can't sit and wait. They can't keep on watching you. So this person knows that you have gone through your fair share of traumas or rejections or disappointments. And they know they have to hurry, they have to rush in because you won't or you might not give another chance to this kind of uh, confusion. Okay, so they want to make it clear to you that you're the one for them. That's something that I'm seeing here. They don't want to disappoint you in love. That is why they're being thorough before they come towards you. Yes, they're right now watching you. They're just simply watching your every move. But now I feel this is a time where they realize they have to make a fast move. Otherwise, you'll be gone. Okay, you'll be gone. So in December, there's a revelation. They can also see you being closed off or they can also see you being a little too guarded. Somewhere I feel like Sagittarius, you may not believe this, but you are a little guarded. Like you might be even knowing who I'm talking to you about, but because you've gone through this past uh, rejection or regret or you know confusions and dilemmas and disappointments you don't want to go through that again so if someone is not coming towards your clear you're done you're not giving them another chance so they know this thing they've understood it and they know they have to break that barrier that you and them have between you guys that friction they want to release that friction so they want to make you comfortable so i'm definitely seeing them coming towards you with the communication so you guys can be first friends and release this friction and then get closer i'm seeing a sexual relationship getting more and more uh, stronger between you guys as i told you this could have been a scorpio You've left the past struggles behind because I got this in the bottom of the deck. I feel like uh, Sagittarius, you on the flip side are working on releasing everything from the past, each and everything. You don't want any memory linked with the past anymore. So you're moving towards rebirth. You're moving towards positive transformation. You don't want to go back. And this is something that's very clear in your head. So if this is someone from the past, I'd say it's not the past person. Okay. They're going to be playing a major role in your life, your person. You guys are going to date. Someone's birthday is on 14th. But I'm seeing you guys dating. There's a huge date offer coming towards you. Main female, main male and courtship. What else do you want me to say to you? You guys need to come out of this comfort zone or if you're too guarded, come out of it because give this person a chance they really want it. And I feel this is definitely like you guys are meant for each other. You guys will date and realize this thing real soon. You both are coming from the similar backgrounds is also what I'm seeing. Yes, this person wants to say this to you. They're very attracted. As I was telling you about the deep burning desire, they definitely have that. Okay, you guys will be dating. Take action. So I feel you already know who this person is or if you don't, this person is about to make act, take action towards you and you guys will be talking a lot about each other. So a lot will be revealed with this person's action towards you. A lot of um, information you will understand about this person and so will they be 
knowing about you. Okay. See, I was telling you about this only. Getting to know each other. Okay. And we have very soon. They will make an offer towards you of separation. You guys are not talking. You guys are not in touch. Maybe you guys don't even know who I'm talking to you about. But this is going to happen. Okay. Yes. You will be saying yes to them. Okay. Someone needs to initiate this. And I feel it's your person that will be initiating this first. Healer. Your person may be a healer or a doctor. Maybe this is you who's a healer or a doctor. You guys may be into the same similar professions like medical profession or a healing profession. And I feel like you guys have just met each other through work. That's also what I'm seeing because of this reason. Hold your vision. If you have some doubt with changing your complete profession, no. That's a message. Daydreams and decision. I was telling you, you might be daydreaming a lot, thinking about, should I do this? Should I do that? Like, you should make a decision, but don't take, like, too many risk or a risk of completely changing your field. That's something that I'm hearing for you. But there's a miracle that's happening. You might face certain challenges, but this is the best way for you to learn, okay? So you're in this learning phase of growing and getting better with each challenge in your life. You're becoming more and more stronger. You'll learn more about yourself, about your dreams, about your life purpose, about your ambition. So a lot is coming into life for you, Sagittarius, with these experiences and life lessons. I was telling you about this, okay? I was not joking. Let's see what more is here. Sagittarius, please. Believe in yourself. If you want to achieve something, all you need to do is just have belief and faith that you can do it. And put all your focus and energy into it. Also, be like a water. Go with the flow. If something doesn't fit right for you, don't try to fix it. Just go with the flow. See the situation. Learn from the uh, situationships. And then take a decision based on it. Okay? Here and now. It's very important for you to be in the present moment to experience what will help you in the long run to have a learning lesson for you to make major changes in your life reflection so if you want a partner you guys need to give each other space and what you want in your partner is what you need to be first what you need to become first okay so these are the signs coming in we have libra we have taurus we have aries we have cancer okay uh i'm gonna see all signs let's see from aries to pisces what does your person feel about you sagittarius aries is seeing you as the one and only they think you're their soulmate taurus wants to marry you they're coming with that offer the gemini wants to get to know you they think you have a healing touch to them they want to be with you Cancer is seeing you as a wish come true. They want you. Leo is a little aggressive or stubborn to change. They want things to be their way. Virgo wants marriage here. Very clearly. Libra sees you as a special someone. They want to be with you. They really like you. Um, Scorpio is confused. Maybe they're not interested. And then we have Sagittarius is coming towards you a little too slow and might get distracted of the other options coming in. Capricorn feels like you're lost. They've lost you and they're regretting it right now instead of taking a, an action. Aquarius is going to take action, going to come towards fast and even more strongly than before. Then we have Pisces, highly interested in you, wants to talk to you, is having deep burning desire. That is it. I'm going to do charms before we end this. You have a friend called Pisces who is Pisces. I feel someone's true face will be revealed by letting you know that they deeply desire you. 
okay if you were confused you will be knowing that they desire this person may play a uh, music to let you know that they feel for you there's some sort of a musical date is also what i'm seeing someone plays guitar for some of you your person has a and e in their name c in their name okay celia cecilia um iron ion something like that okay celine selena Aileen, someone's from Canada. Um, love is gonna be getting deeper for you. Other messages for you are we have six and we have three. Let's see. It could mean that um, Traveling is something that's going to happen to you, but it has a major effect in your life. Traveling, okay, it has a major effect in your life. Um, I feel like there's some sort of a major change that's going to come with this traveling, okay? So that's what I'm seeing. That is all. I hope you've enjoyed. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share it. Do comment down below, and I'll see you again with more videos like this. Bye. Take care of yourself. Love you.